Let's take a look at defining and inserting a block. A block definition can include the block name, the block geometry, the location of the base point to be used for aligning the block when you insert it, and any attribute data you want to include. For this video, I'll turn the geometry of this window into a block. After the block is defined, I can insert the new block, saving drawing file size and making it easier to modify later if needed. From the Block panel, I'll select Create. I'll give the new block a name and click Select Objects. I'll select the objects I want to include in my new block and press Enter. Next, I need to define a base point for the block. The base point is used for aligning the block when it's inserted. I'll click Pick Point and use a midpoint object snap to select the base point of the window. I'll make sure Open in Block Editor is unchecked and Convert to Block is selected before I click OK. Now when I click on the Insert button, I get a list of available blocks I can use. With the geometry of the window converted to a block, I can insert the new block wherever it's needed in my drawing.